first in the corner to my left from Atlanta, Georgia. Weighing tonight at 185 pounds, he is the highest flyer in the game. July of 2018, Limitless Wrestling presents the first annual Vacation Land Cup. Top shelf, Troy Nelson being joined by Max Smashmaster. Troy, I am fired up. This match couldn't headline any one of the shows that we've had in the past three years here at Limitless Wrestling, and we're getting it first. <laughs> it's, it's like Christmas in July, if you will. Fox meets Josh Briggs, and we're off to the races already with an Inzagiri. I absolutely this couldn't have said it better myself, and, and this one is... We don't know what's going to happen. Neither of these men have touched in a limitless ring, I don't believe. I was saying, I don't. Were they in the part of that six man tag? This is definitely the first singles encounter, I do believe. But here. They, did not, oh, they did not have much of, a, of an interaction there. They did touch, but they did not have much of it. You know, there wasn't a pinfall between the two, is what I'm saying. Absolutely. And think about how hard these two competitors are going to go. We've seen plenty of them. What if I told you they're going to have to go even harder? There's a fatal four way tonight to crown the Vacation Land Cup champion. And there are a lot of thoughts when you're going into matches like these knowing you have a big match later on you, you have to either finish it quick or give it at all because you have a competitor like AR Fox standing across the ring from you. Absolutely, and there's a lot of unfinished business in this tournament. Later on, we see matches. JT Dunn meets David Starr. Josh, hold on one oh. second here. Josh Briggs catches AR Fox, but AR Fox nothing. is fighting away and drops him down again with a second backbreaker working on that back. If you can't, if you can't feel your back, if your lower back is hurt, you can't feel your legs, and you can't be flying off those ropes. Absolutely, and that's going to be the endurance game between this match and the second one. And I'll tell you what, a lot of history. You gotta believe that Josh Briggs is gonna want to get his hands on JT Dunn. Christian Casanova looking to break Hold on out. One second here. Oh, oh, amazing trip there by AR Fox going all the way up and over. Reverse skinning the cat and tripping Josh Briggs. Josh Briggs smacked the back of his head there. Kicked in the face for his troubles by AR Fox. Getting this crowd behind him, this raucous crowd here in Nashville, Maine. AR Fox scaling to the top strand. What's he gonna come off with here? Looks like he was going with a, a little flying knee there, but Josh Briggs follows him in, hitting that big back elbow. Like I'm Josh, starting to think that Josh Briggs doesn't like him. Josh Briggs is the hater of all, the destroyer, but he just he just caught uh, his nether region there on the top rope. This is going to be a time for AR Fox to take a breather. Yes, you got to stay on the big man, but like I said, an endurance game. Try to catch your breath. Save a little more. These two guys have the biggest advantage. Oh, my God. Spike Hunter can run off the ropes. That could be it. Air Fox get on him. Stay on him. The adulation from the crowd, but Josh Briggs smacked the back of his head and then drove the front of his head right into the ring right there. They had the random drawings to see the order of matches, and these two have got to be at least happy. They paired off, but they're going to have the biggest rest in between this and the finals. Beautiful oh kick God. up, moves out to the floor. And the crowd is letting him hear it. Can you hear them in here, Max? You, you can hear them because there's, what, 400? Oh, close to 500 people packed into this armory. They want to see someone walk out of here with that trophy tonight. A lot of new faces here. Limitless Wrestling. Putting wrestling not just on the map here in Maine, but in New England. AR Fox now looking for a submission. Almost like a Billy Goat's curse, but just a float but over. Got him into... It looks like a little dragon suit wow. with the reach around. Into the, no, 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 no. Hook the hands. Nice snap mirror reversal. Briggs too strong as Josh Briggs, but he's taken back a little bit. Bandeas over the top rope. Foxy holds on. Blocks the end Zagiri. Josh Briggs now got oh, no. him. Goozled. All the way up and onto oh. the apron goes AR Fox. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he caught the ropes on the way down, man. What a landing. Nice way to hyperextend your elbow, separate your shoulder. He's trying to catch the rope so he doesn't, he doesn't take all that impact, but he could have hurt himself even worse. Briggs showing up, just dipping up over the top rope. And 
Showing his just agility I right think there. You get him in the ring and pin him. You're going to have him. Let's not forget, we're talking about the Vacation Land Cup, your main event for the evening. Ten months in the making. Anthony Green meets Ace Romero in a steel cage match tonight, Max. I cannot believe it. I, I can't wait for that one. It's really unbelievable. These two men have been going at it for years, but let's not take away from the match that's in the ring. Absolutely. And the devastation that's being given to uh, Air Fox, but out of nowhere, able to do a, a little bit of a, a Tiger fan kick through the bottom and, and hitting uh, Josh Breeze on that injured shoulder. You see he wears that, that brace. Oh, he gets caught. Oh. Josh Briggs see, caught him. AR Fox was slow to get back on him, shaking the cobweb still, even after the Tiger faint kick, and that might make all the difference. I think Josh Briggs is just Josh. having a seat, taking a spot with the fans there. He knows that he's got AR Fox right where he wants him. This is turning into the Josh Briggs show. My goodness. Josh Briggs got AR Fox back in. He's going for a one. Oh, almost it. But Just AR Fox wants two. out. Look at him. Yeah, look at the. You can tell he got popped right on the chest there and, and it drove the air out of him. He's gasping for air right now. Brace trying to catch his breath, trying to get that endurance. Taking a little bit too much time for my liking. Max, you're a big man. If you were in this scenario, oh, what do you do? Whoa, whoa, whoa. AR Fox had a bottle of, uh, of water in the ring. Just. Stunned uh, Josh Briggs, cracked him right on the side of the head. What is Kevin Quinn going to do about that? Uh, it was just a water bottle. I mean, it couldn't have been. Cut it Josh took Briggs him off his feet. Anything, but it absolutely stunned him. But Josh Briggs back up. First man to his feet coming in. Oh, his boots. Beautiful. Boots AR boots Fox. Rearranging his face. Think about how hot it is in this building, too, Max, with that yeah. sidewalk slam. Spinning him around. Round and around. Where's he going to go? Disorienting uh, AR Fox here. Oh, oh, with a big sidewalk oh. slam. That could be it. Oh, I held my breath on that one. This is just the first match in, in, in an amazing night of action that we're having here at Limitless Wrestling. And I know that I'm going to lose my voice uh, after just, what, six minutes of this match Absolutely. so far? That, that's about as much as has, has elapsed. Say, think about how warm it is in this building. Got to be taking a toll. Even the most well-conditioned athlete in this event. You can see uh, the rain outside. If you look right across the ring, it's just coming down. And, and as Josh Briggs rains down shots on AR Fox. Big chop to the chest of AR Fox. And Josh Briggs still kind of methodical and taking his time. Going to be shooting Fox off here, I believe. Fox puts on the brakes. Josh Briggs, he seems like he doesn't want to he doesn't want to go 100 miles an hour. He has AR Fox right where he wants him. He just needs to finish him off. But Josh Briggs knows he has a second match if he wins this one. Against three other opponents, Max. But AR Fox picking up steam. Beautiful neck breaker. AR Fox that. knows. He knows he must go 100 miles an hour to take on someone like Josh Briggs. But how many wins does someone like AR Fox has? He's on his second right now. Catches another boot. Shoots him off. AR Fox there. Little sling blade. Oh, stacks him up high on his neck. AR Fox is somehow getting to the top rope unbelievably quick. Be taking too much time. Fox ready. Unbelievable swan top bump. Stacking him up. One, two. Oh. The elevation on that swanton bump, just getting as much air so he can drive all of his weight onto the chest of Josh Briggs. AR Fox now. This crowd solemnly behind Fox. There's Over no doubt about him. it. If you're Josh Briggs, you've got to be surprised right now. End up all, got the way, all the way up into an iconoclasm there. Oh, what he likes to call, I hope you die, but. I think uh, AR Fox hopes uh, Josh Briggs dies one of these seconds. Short on one of these cutter. amazing cutters. Oh, oh my God! Did you see the arch in his All the way back! He rolled all the way back! He's to keep those fingers. I think he's going to try to walk sleeper. those fingers again. If AR Fox can walk the fingers, it's over. The fans here are rabid. They want to see Josh Briggs go on. Can he, he reach back? He could not walk the fingers, Max. Josh Briggs sliding all the way behind. Man, I barely holding on and driving him into the corner. Now Josh Briggs looking more worse for the wear. Those short elbows just driving the point. Oh! Oh! What a maneuver! That's it. Inside oh, that's out. Gotta be it. Into a go to hell. Two. Three. Oh! 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 O
Kevin almost Kevin Kranz advanced. I almost said three. I, Kevin I, Kranz is saying two. I thought it was it. There's thunder outside in here. There's thunder inside here. Thunder inside. <laughs> oh, Max, I would have bet the farm that that was going to be three. That go to hell. Oh, you my goodness. You know it's bad when I have a headache. Ten minutes into the first matchup here. <laughs> It's limitless wrestling, only the way that Maine can provide here. Wait a minute, wrestling. Air Fox back. He almost jumped all the way to the top rope with that forearm to the back of Josh Briggs. Fox for here. Could be looking for almost maybe a Death Valley yeah, driver. Got to look for a Death Valley bomb style. Right, Death, Death Valley, Valley bomb. Drops it. Josh Briggs high on his neck. Fox, what could be looking for now? Could be looking for another senton. Up to the second. Another swanton, maybe. Third. Air Fox taking his time here, yeah, getting his balance. Could this be to his detriment? 450, wait a minute. Oh! Josh Briggs catches him with a goozle. It's going to be Maroon 5's last hit. No. All the way through, Rose Air Fox. Oh, boot to the face. Boot to the face. Lane to Gary. He was got him up. Another Death Valley bump. Fox is going for him. This has got to be it. He can't He's wait. For the hit w. it, Fox. Hit it. 450! That's this it! Is it. One, two, oh! oh. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me! I don't believe it! First match, Max! The Destroyer will not go down! Yeah. Got a cross arm here. Irish whip reversal. Misses in the corner. Big boot to the face of AR Fox. AR Fox cannot mount any offense at this point. Lomain pain! No, Lomain caught! Fox on the, no. Oh, oh no, don't Jesus even tell Christ, me. Don't do it. Not from the top. Jeez Louise! Oh my god! Bruce Fox oh, second hit! Get it. It's over! That's over! The first accompanied to ringside by the hardest working man in sports and entertainment, the Godfather of Soul, Stokely Hathaway. <laughs> Representing his dream team from Atlanta, Georgia. And just like Rich Palladino said, do not blink in this match. My name is D.L. Hurst, and I am here with Christian Casanova. We have Austin Theory going up against DJ Z. D.L., you're here with the top talent. You need to give me a proper introduction. Here we go. Let's get into things here. Austin Theory. Oh, man. Uh, man, like that Rich boy said, is good. Just like Rich said, don't blink. Here we go. Oh, no, no. Let's take a moment to see how good Stokely looks with that uh, DJ Z gear on. I don't know. I don't think he looks as good as DJ Z with it on. See, this is going to be good. DJ Z's quick, Austin Theory's strong, and he's quick. So uh, my money's on Dream Team's Austin Theory. I feel like you have a little bit of a bias here, though, Christian. I feel like you don't have an opinion to talk because you ain't Dream Team. All right, all right. Here we go. Ooh. Nope. Big shoulder tackle. Austin Theory takes up. We got beautiful lead frog. DJ Z is showing how quick he is. Car wheel oh. city, baby. Take him over. Here we go. Uh, catch that. Oh, on the feet. Oh. 
Beautiful double leg sweep. Takedown, kick out. Oh, double kip oh, up. Here we go. Uh, that stops Allen right there. Don't blink, ladies and gentlemen. Don't blink. This is any man's game, but it's going to Austin Theory. I'm sorry. Oh, Austin Theory. Beautiful, beautiful technique. With the blind side. With the ha, 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 ha. Look at that. Uh, I don't know That's how you do it, Theory. That's DJ's thing. Hey, keep an eye on Stokely. He's doing magic on the outside. Austin Theory with the stiff forearm. I second that. Like I said, Kristen, I think you got a little bit of a bias in here, but Austin Theory is in control. Oh! oh. That's how we do it. Oh. Huge shot by Austin Theory. I fall oh, day. Over. Oh! Caught and him with the just super like kick. that, DJ Z's on top. Oh, no. What's DJ good. Z doing? What's DJ Z doing? I don't know, but my boy Theory better get out the way. Oh, oh no, 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 no. DJ Z! Man down. Somebody check on Theory. He looks hurt. All right, that's DJ obnoxious. Z coming through. Here we go. With the shoulder block. DJ Z showing his quickness again. The kick to the midsection. Oh, with the back that's elbow. Awesome. Austin Theory may be hurt, but he ain't down for the count. He's got some tricks up his sleeve, a.k.a. Looking, Stokely Hathaway on the outside, baby. It's looking like he might take that L, Christian. The only L's Austin Stokely Theory Hathaway. takes Come his on. Oh. oh! Here we go. Big line. Oh! Oh! Double stomp, baby. Here we go. Big rolling oh, suplex. The, oh! Big suplex by Austin Theory on DJZ with the cover. I am just the two count. Not enough to keep DJ, DJ Z down just yet. You heard him. That was five. Why is he going for a five count, Christian? Oh. All right. Austin Theory in control. Hits him with those big old forearms. You see the size of this kid's forearms? From what I understand, you big whip. in bodybuilding before this. Beautiful. Double A, baby. One, two. Another two count. Austin Theory has to do a little bit more to keep DJ Z down. Back up one more guy. Oh. You don't know suplex? Oh, Austin He's taking Theory him to suplex city. His dominance. Let's go. One, two. Here we go. Put him in that hole. Slow him down. Choke him out. Take the life out of him, Theory. Austin Theory does have those big biceps. I will give him that. Is he fighting back up? Come on. Oh. Cut him back down. That's how we do it. Oh. Big knees to the gut. What's he going for here? Gut wrench. Beautiful. Look at the power. Oh. Look at the power. That's dream team worthy power right there. That was a gut wrench jack. And Stokely Hathaway approves. Oh. Catch him with the back elbow. Oh, Come on, Theory. The boot. Don't fall for that twice. Here we go. He's going for a tilt to world. And. Oh, oh. oh, with the reverse DDT. Catching him completely off guard. DJ Z looks to be gaining some momentum. I got to say, DJ Z is very innovative. I will give him that. And he is top talent. Oh, with this, another shoulder tackle from the outside. DJ Z comes in. We're going here. Oh. Nope. That line Today. wasn't enough to take Theory down. Go for one more. Nope. Stay up, Theory. Oh, ducks it. Oh, ducks that Double one. Duck. Oh, with the running clothesline. Sends him off. We got. Oh, the back, big back elbow. elbow. Oh, springboard. Oh, oh, he got the knees, knees up. Oh. He got the knees up. What's Theory going for? He's putting him away. This is it. Oh, DJ Z falls up. Good save. Oh! 
no, no, he has no, a no, cut. No, no. Power bomb from the corner. Does he catch it with? No. Oh. No, no, no. no. DDT almost lost him, but he got enough. He kicked out. He kicked out. And Theory kicks out. Oh, what's Stokely doing over there with Theory? What's he doing, Christian? He's minding those, his own business. That's what you should be doing. DL the worst. Uh, All right, Theory's got to the get out of there. Here we go, here we go. Big roll up, big drop kick. Oh, what a thing of beauty. Pick him right up. What's he going for? Put him down. Oh! That's it. All day. All day. One, One two. two. No, 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 And no, no, no. kicks out. No, no, we need a recount. We need a recount. A recount? That was clearly Who's that referee in there? Who does he work for? Randy doesn't work for the Dream Team. Definitely not. Kevin Quinn would have counted three. Come on, put him away, Theory. One more of them little swingy things he's done. Theory is in control. Looking for DJ Z to... Here we go. This, this is it. This is the finish. Like... Oh. Passes him with a job, Jacker. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's over him. Off the ropes. Here we oh, go. This is it right here. Him. He's put away many men with this. That's it. Oh! oh. One, two. One, two. Oh. He kicks out. I saw Austin Theory beat John Cena with that move with my own eyes. DJZ kicked out of that. What else can Theory bring to the table? He should get the tables. Don't worry, Stokely Hathaway's got a plan. How is DJZ DJ standing? The ref. No, 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 no! Oh, with a poison runner! No, stop him. Got? What does he got? Oh! Big DDT off the top! Ready to get that rope? One, two! Beautiful. See what I tell you. Did I not tell you Stokely Hathaway will come in clutch? Stokely Hathaway yeah, saves the day. That. Stokely put Theory's leg on that rope. Shut up, DL, you snitch. Uh, DJ, no, he better face. not. He better not touch him. Stokely is a triathlete marathon runner. He will not catch him. Oh, here we go. This is it right here, baby. Buckle ball by Theory. Don't blink. Here's to the gut. What does he got? Let me Beautiful! Oh! All day! Two, three! Dream Team for the win! Undefeated! You know, DL, shut up! And let up me, let me take one. care of it from here. Austin Theory, one of the best young talents out there right now. Stokely Hathaway, the GOAT! Dream Team for the win! What's new? I'll give it to him. Theory asserted his dominance at that end of that match, but DJZ almost had it. And DJZ came to play. That was a great, great, great bout. But you know, Dream Team got to do it every single time. I've been going to Limitless a lot and been fighting a lot of small guys. That's not really what I'm looking for. I want to go to Limitless and get into a real fight. What do you say? You got yourself a fight. Yeah, right? I wonder if you're gonna make it. I told you to be here. Had some money to mess with. Gentlemen, we are back here for the second half of the three-year anniversary show. And what a match to come back with. Challenge accepted Josh Briggs one-on-one -on -one with a man surprisingly just as big as him, Brody King.
That'd I'm be enough. Sorry to cut you off. The only man involved in this match right now that was at the first show in a professional wrestling match was me. Oh, I guess you're not wrong in that. Anthony Green and Danger Kid here to call the action. And the crowd is split, to say the least. These guys are smiling. Like, this is terrifying. These two forces colliding, and they're just smiling at each other. Imagine if, imagine if you knew you could literally kick anyone's ass, and you had a guy across the ring from you that was just as big, just as bad, just as tattooed. That's what makes this terrifying. Like, this is, like, this is dangerous. The ring's going to break. Like, we had to reinforce it at intermission. Like, and I, I still can't even guarantee it'll hold up. And these guys are just going to, they're going to hit each other so hard. You just wait for it. I'm glad like, they reinforced the ring. I wish they reinforced that cage last year. Yeah, well, you know what? We're not going to talk about that. Big lockup here from the two men jockeying for position, feeling each other out. This is a first-time matchup, right, Anthony Green? Actually, they have competed before in oh, July at Beyond Wrestling. American oh. Rana. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. So I have not seen that match. Second who, ever. Do you know who won that match? Yes, Josh Briggs, which All started right. his undefeated streak in Beyond Wrestling. I All believe right. All right. he's now 3-0 and since well, he said he would be undefeated. At, at the moment, Brody King's got the upper hand. But look at the look at the athleticism. Look at that beautiful neck bridge. Yeah, this is something you would see some cruiserweights doing. But these two huge behemoths are out here going tit for tat on holds right now. Still in the feeling out process. As you see, uh, Josh Briggs is changing that wrist lock from the chest to the forehead, just getting a little more uh, leverage on it. A little more for reversal. And, you know, this is something we haven't really seen yet tonight. All, every match, I feel like, has started off pretty hot, a lot of action. And who would have thunk that Brody King and Josh Briggs would be starting off going hold for hold of all the matches? It kind of reminds me of when Kane and Big Show decided to chain wrestle on Raw. Oh, yeah. Good memories. I don't know. These guys seem pretty evenly matched, though. I mean, Josh Briggs has a, a win over Brody King, as we talked about earlier. But we'll see what happens here tonight. It could be anything. This is going to be a wild ride, Anthony Green. Now, let's be honest, DK. Between these two men, if they shoulder tackled either of us, we'd be through that mat right now. Oh, yeah. I would die. I'd probably just die. Brody King able to stay on his feet. Uh-oh. What Going are they doing the ring, now? I miss Shades something. of New Japan Wrestling. I think they're challenging each other oh, to the okay. ultimate shoulder tackle. Oh, okay. The oh. Ring, this ring only gives you 16 to 18 feet. Are you not wrong? This is smart. Now they're going wow. 40, 40 feet. Do you hear that thud? The camera crew is trying to get out of the way. Rightfully so. I wouldn't want to be in the way of that. That's terrifying. Josh Briggs already has a very bad right shoulder. Now he's just over and over hitting Brody King with his left. Yep. Looks like he hit the post. Now these guys are finally coming to blows. This is where the heavy strikes are going to start being thrown. Josh Briggs, the upper hand now, working over Brody King on the outside. I think, he's, yeah, he's already got him back in the ring. Josh Briggs smells blood in the water. Off the ropes goes King. Whoa! <laughs> what the fuck? Brody King with a fucking hurricanrana. Josh Briggs with a fucking hurricanrana of his own. What the fuck? Tit for tat. Who's better than who? Unbelievable. Brody King goes for a choke slam. Josh Briggs flips out of it, ducks the clothesline off the ropes, Double kicks two. away the kick. Double supers. Nope, not today. Oh. I feel like I'm watching a Japanese kung fu oh. movie between two of the biggest, most badass wrestlers in the region. That was insane. I don't think I've ever seen a more evenly matched pairing in Josh Briggs and Brody King. I mean, at least not in Limitless Wrestling. Who, no. Who's the other biggest guy here? Probably Ace Romero. That's probably the other or a Brian guy. Cage. Brian Ca oh, Maybe yeah. Brian Cage and Chris Brian Dickinson Cage is in his own, is, it is in a, it is his own uh, genre of yes. largeness. He's a completely different entity. He's a goddamn action figure. Let me provoke the question. Could you imagine Josh Briggs and Brody King as a tag team? I think, I think that's been... Uh, 
teased as an idea for many promotions. I don't think it's it's yet to happen. I don't think these guys see each other enough. Believe it or not, I believe other than Limitless Wrestling, Beyond Wrestling is the only place these two have been in the same locker room. That's fair. That's fair. Brody King coming to us from California. Josh Briggs, New England based himself. So I this did, is something special. I did commentary on Brody King's debut here against Christian Casanova. And those chops he was just throwing oh, yeah. people, in cave to Christian Casanova's chest. People are still talking about those chops. They are so loud. It was sickening. If, Absolutely sickening. If you listen close enough when you go outside, you can still hear the echo of oh. that chop. Stop short, big elbow. Off, Off the, the ropes. ropes. Oh. Big black gold slam from Brody King. Unless you're from my era, it is a boss man. Slam boss man, bag. black hole, whatever the fuck you want to call it. He's still kicked out, though. What does Brody King have to do to put Josh Briggs away? Crowd starting to come alive, starting to get behind. Yep. Slowly oh, but surely, just, just like the wave. Just looking for that dominator. Oh, maybe a power bomb. bomb. Up, slips it. Oh, enough strength. That, that's all that legs. That's, that, that's all squats and deadlifts right there that he was able to push him off. Beautiful spinning backbreaker only for two counts is Kevin Quinn. Now what does Josh Briggs have to do to put the other big man away? This is amazing, folks. This is something special. Briggs feeling it. Pumping himself up, trying to get the crowd behind him. I'm feeling it. Are you feeling it, AG? I am feeling Oh, he's going for go to hell. Oh, my God! Stan Hansen type Larian. Turn him inside out, upside down, whatever. There's the power bomb. Cover. That Josh ring did Briggs. not move on that power no. bomb. Kevin Quinn saying two count only. I mean, a combination like that, those are two big time maneuvers. Oh, Hitting yes. someone with a lariat, just knocking their head off, and then immediately picking them up where they have no idea where they are, and immediately powerbombing them in the middle of the ring. And a lot of you know, a lot of people don't think about the, the build of a wrestling ring. There's a spring under there, but you've got a guy like Brody King standing right where you're landing. There's no gives. You're just hitting a solid mat, and it, it hurts. Especially if you bobble your head. Josh Briggs going for the I don't like you. Big kick in the corner. What Brody King is this. Oh, is he going for that Maroon 5? No. Oh, big German. German. And what? Oh. Holy oh. shit. And that's it, folks. Josh Briggs wins it. Christian Casanova, but they were shooting him off. And a double close line Take takes him down. down. Pepper Parks oh. doesn't even have his jacket off. Lines him out over the top. Cleared out the ring. Did Pepper Parks. That's Wait a minute. Tope got him. Takes down oh the dream This isn't going to be a long one tonight. I've never seen him do that. In all my time with Noah Pepper Parks, I've never seen him pull that out of his arsenal. He may not be a Buffalo brother, but he is the Buffalo father. Lighting up Christian Casanova. And Puff, I know this means a lot to you. I know you wish you could be in there, but you got business to attend to right yourself tonight. Going for a oh. kick on the head. Oh, it's Schoolboy by Christian Casanova. Carlos out of it. Catches the boot. Oh, oh. kicks him right in the face. Oh. 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 Punch right to the ribs by Austin Theory. Austin Theory. And, and Puff, what does this match mean to you? Oh. oh. It means the world. It's for my hey, brother. This is Kevin. one of your brothers. Down right now. Oh! I'm sorry. Nice. I'm a little, I'm a little emotional after seeing this. I can, I can hear it in your voice. 
I, I'm happy you signed up for this match tonight. It, it's all right, man. It's been a rough week. I, I, I can only imagine, and I know all the fans of Limitless Wrestling can only imagine how rough of a week, but you're here. And we're happy to have you, and we wish the best for your brothers. But right now, it's not looking good for your father as the Dream Team is just taking it to, to Pepper Parks. Come on. Oh! It's crazy to see him here in Limitless Wrestling all the way in Maine. He came out for our brother, Kevin Blackwood, who's down right now. That, that's, what, that's what family does. It's awesome theory. Oh, still not able to keep Pepper Parks down. After all that offense, he was able to string together. He doesn't know what's going now. Uh, a little bit of showboating, but throwing some, some close fist right to the ribs. Eric Greenleaf not able to see it. Oh, hey, come on. Just wrestle the match. Well, she didn't even instigate. A furious strike of Kevin. Uh, Pepper in the corner. I Christian Casanova here. throwing those strikes, but not even covering up. He, he, you think he's he's has Pepper hurt? He, I can't see him ailing any in injury, but all that offense from Austin Theory must have done its uh, work on him. Pepper breaking out of the hole from Casanova, lighting him up with chops. Ah, oh. uh, but Christian able to go right with to those the gut, knees. cuts him right off in the middle of the ring. Oh, and a big power slam! Big big. Power slam. Ooh, Austin Theory, Theory just able. The ref needs to get him out of the ring. He got two guys in the ring on Pepper right now, and it's unbelievable. I think Christian Casanova whacked his head on that because he was definitely down for the three count. If Austin Theory wasn't there, that would have been it. Look at the power of Austin Theory. Pepper is not a small man, but able, able to just throw him right up. Oh, kicks him right on the back of the neck. Oh, rebound leg drop. We got two guys in the ring. Come on! The ref is just letting Casanova and Theory just have their way in this ring, and he needs to he needs to enforce the rules. Dream Team knows how to bend the rules in, in their favor, and they're absolutely doing that. Harlow trying to get the crowd behind them because they're just watching on. But think of the experience of the Dream Team compared to Harlow and, and Pepper. I don't think they've ever teamed before in the wrestling match. They may know each other, but they have never teamed before. That lack of experience is uh, now. The ref being distracted by Harlow, he needs to be Here's another lack watching. of experience. Now, you, you don't have to get in there just because someone instigates. You don't have to run in there because then it could be a detriment to your tag team partners we just saw there. Less than a week to prepare for this match. They they knew what to do. Austin Theory going up for something. Pepper tried to counter it. Austin catches it with a shot to the back of the head and then a really tight right on the ear forearm. Looking to injure Pepper Parks. Oh! Here we go. He catches him. Got him down. Pepper. Oh! Here he's down. Spinning tombstone. So Come on. He's got to get that tag to Harlow. He's got him. Crowd hyping him up. Stokely Hathaway yet to interject himself into this contest. But he is a lion in wait outside. In comes Casanova. Oh, she takes him down with a Polish hammer. Oh. A second one. Third time's the charm. Oh, oh catches him. Oh, oh you're in oh, position into a face buster. Spikes Christian Casanova. Wait a minute. All the way through. She lands oh, on her oh. feet. Stutter! Stutter is out. Stutter is out. Come on. Marlon Harris yeah. is on fire. Oh, what she got here? What you got here for Do Theory. it! Do it for Kevin! Harlow on the apron. Do it for Dan. Oh, come Are on! Are you kidding me? Ref! Get the Stokely out of here! Unbelievable! Crossbody takes down Austin Theory! He's down. There we go. Able to fend Ball off and back in the, ring. the attacker, Stokely Hathaway. Casanova breaks her hold. Oh. oh, and a boot right to the face of Harlow. Yeah, Come on. a little bit of uh, playing opossum by Christian Casanova. I'm sure he was taught that by Stokely Hathaway. Why is he calling Stokely up for the apron? Stokely! Stokely just threw Stokely! Wait, 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 wait. We've seen him utilize that chain before. 
Stokely. Get, oh, this is just a miscarriage of Wrapping the chain oh, no, no, around no, no, no. his fist, but that's Pepper today. Parks. He's Not got him. Oh, Looks him up. Oh, oh no, boo. Wait a minute. The referee. Kick him right in between the legs. Harlow Hart makes a pass. The chain Jane goes flying. Oh. Super kick to Harlow. Twist her into oh. it. That's it. Oh. No. Kick out. Oh. Unbelievable. Harlow Hart and Pepper Parks not able to pick up the win. Casanova kicked him right in between the legs. Puff, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I have nothing else to say, man. There's a miscarriage of justice, that referee, and I'm going to have a talk with him in the locker room. God, I'm so... You go. You do what you have to do, but do not put your hands on him. You can't. You, you can't be suspended. You can't be fined. He kicked Pepper. I know. I know, man. It is Pepper Shaker. And now he's attacking him. At hey, the hey, hey, hey! Are you kidding me? Let's go. Hey. Smash Master here, this is an amazing matchup, one that we never thought we would see. Sean Spears, Retro AG, and Tommy Dreamer. This one has a bit of story behind it. Uh, earlier in the week, Sean Spears pulled from this appearance, but able to make the appearance later on in the week. Tommy Dreamer was the fill-in, but now we have our first ever Vacation Land Cup that has nine participants. The ninth being a, a, a legend in this business, Tommy Dreamer, added earlier this week. 
lot of confusion, as you were just alluding to. I mean, it would have been easy for just a regular promoter to be like, okay, well, never mind. We got Tommy Dreamer. Yeah, you're unbooked, it. kid. Yeah. <laughs> How do you do that to Tommy Dreamer? <laughs> yeah. Or, 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 or Sean Spears. Who, exactly. You know, exactly. I mean, AEW or no AEW. But that shows a testament to AEW as a company yeah. allowing him, uh, you know, f fulfill his duties elsewhere, yeah. uh, not just pulling him, turning up their nose and turning away from uh, the independent wrestling of the world. As we see the, the new chairman, yeah. uh, the perfect 10, Sean Spears, quickly powdering out. Not sure whether he's going to be. That's been a sportsmanship uh, between Tommy Dreamer and, and Anthony Green here. You know, Rich, you and I have known Anthony Green for a lot longer than pretty much anyone else in this room uh, since he was a fresh-faced and quite annoying young person <laughs> who was starting out as a referee, what, 10 years ago? He was just a, a boy at that time, and he is a full-grown man now. And you can see um, Sean Spears is taking the easy way out in this one. AG has quickly become the it guy in pro wrestling here on one of the biggest weekends, the biggest weekend of his career. Currently holds a contract with Evolve Wrestling. And here he is in Portland, Maine, 24 hours before he and Josh Briggs will compete one-on-one -on -one in the Evolve 10th Anniversary Special, which will, oh yeah, by the way, be broadcast live on the WWE <laughs> Network. Uh, and, <laughs> and honestly, AG easily could have pulled off of this card of to keep himself could. safe and healthy for uh, for this weekend that's coming up, Evolve. I, I don't know where AG is on the card, but imagine being the first ever independent match that could take place on the WWE Network. Think about that, folks. 2019 is wild. Yeah, it certainly is. Now we've got, of course, the innovator of violence, Tommy Dreamer, the uh, nearly 30-year veteran. Yes, the, the new chairman taking over the reins from La Parca <laughs> is the former Ty Dillinger. Doesn't want to be known as that name. He wants to be known as his name proper, Sean Spears. Entering the ring is Sean Spears finally for the first time in this matchup. Spears, another longtime veteran. The former Gavin Spears yeah. of OVW fame, where he teamed with Cody Rhodes. We all know about the chair shot heard around the world. Uh, he and Cody Rhodes. He's asked for a timeout. We both know there's no <laughs> timeouts at wrestling. As this one's starting to pick up. <laughs> AG and uh, TD going to work together. Duking and jiving and jabbing is AG. Way, way. <laughs> Going for a bionic elbow. Oh, there's one. <laughs> There's one from Tommy Dreamer! Dreamer, of course, wearing the polka dots of his favorite wrestler of all time, the American Dream, Dusty Rhodes. Teamwork, back elbows, and double elbow drops, but there can only be one winner. That's it. And as we can see there, Tommy Dreamer said, hey, brother, let the vet get the pin. The winner of this match goes to tonight's main event, which will be a four-way elimination match for the Vacation Land Cup. We've got JT Dunn, we've got Ace Romero, we've got Kevin Blackwood. Winner of this match will round out the field of four, drop toe hold, and the big elbow. What would that mean for each one of these competitors? Sean Spears going into the fight for the fall of tomorrow night, uh, 8.30 on BR Live, holding the Vacation, vacation Land Cup trophy. Uh, Tommy Dreamer, you know, in his 30 years of experience, being able to pick up the, the win in the Vacation Lane Cup, if he, if he does so. Or Anthony Green, the first, you know, independent, one of the first independent wrestlers to ever be featured on the WWE Network. What if he wins? This, this, there's so many stakes to this entire matchup. There certainly are. And don't forget, the winner of the Vacation Lane Cup tournament gets a guaranteed title shot on September 6th against our Limitless Wrestling Champion. Too busy to be here tonight. MJF, he's better than you, and you know it, Maxwell Jacob Friedman. Oh, I heard he was he was on his yacht just off the port of Hyannis, watching this, somehow streaming this. We don't even have streaming capabilities, but he was streaming this event live 
on his phone, his iPad, and his Android device. So that's awesome because all these plugs that we've made that are time sensitive to everything happening right here this weekend, only MJF is actually uh, getting wind of it. Yeah, Everybody else can is, hear it after the fact. He is, absolutely. But it gives us credibility. Listen, we know what's going on. We know what's going on. It's not, we're not pretending like we're showing this off or we're recording this elsewhere. We are here live and the action has been hot and heavy as it's picking up. Sean Spears just taking it to Tommy Dreamer. Wait a minute, he's calling for a fan. There is a child! Oh! <laughs> Thunderous blow by that young man on the chest of Sean Spears! The limitless crowd is erupting! Just made that kid's life. Oh, oh no. no! Dreamer misses the chop, hits the ring post. You can see his fingers bend around that ring, that ring post. They have dislocated one. You know Sean Spears is going to take advantage of that. Look at him staring at that kid at ringside. Oh, he better not put that. Oh, hey, hey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Where is security? We got 117 security guards. They're all up in the aisle way. Yeah, they're all they're all cheering because the kid's old. They're not even paying attention. Oh, my God. Back to the action. Dreamer takes a chop to the chest from Sean Spears. Tommy Dreamer known to wear that shirt in the ring, able to, whoa, whoa. Hey, oh, watch your mouth, young man. You do not speak to a child like that. Oh, come on. Disgusting display of unsportsmanlike conduct from Sean Spears. Neck breaker on Dreamer, goes for the pin, gets one. Dreamer immediately kicks out. Tommy Dreamer may have uh, just been booked less than a week ago, but he's going full bore in hopes of winning this match and going on to the finals. Think about the matchups that we could see uh, with that finals. Uh, JT Dunn just advancing to the finals. Uh, he proclaimed last time we were here that he was going to, uh, to take on MJF. He was going to go back to back and take on MJF. Uh, oh, what about Sean Spears or Tommy Dreamer or even Anthony Green going on to take on MJF? With all these matchups, dream matchups across the world as Sean Spears uh, saluting the crowd. Saluting the crowd, double middle fingers. Oh, and a taste of his own medicine. AG has got a sip of water. Oh, he, ah! he went all Muda on him. In the mouth, <laughs> spinning in the mouth of Sean Spears. That's disgusting. Retro AG is green. on fire. And fuego, as they say south of the border. That means on fire. Yes. yes. Oh, big backbreaker. The Cutting fans, down the steam. The fans are not chanting AG sucks. No, they are chanting AG, AG something that AG runs. trucks. Trucks yeah. along as he, yeah. he trucks along in this matchup. Yeah, you said it before, you hit the nail on the head. 2019, what a weird year for pro it's wrestling. It's wild, man. You can chant AGFs and it's... it's Kids are chanting it. Kids are Mother, chopping, chopping. Mothers, grandmothers, everyone. And there's the tens. Even though they hate them, they'll still like to chant 10. Oh, and just not giving it to the crowd. The chairman, if you will as now he's going to go to work on Tommy Dreamer. And he's looking right at that kid that chopped him in the chest. Oh. The, the southpaw driving those left hands into the head of Tommy Dreamer, but inverted atomic drop. He, driving that coccyx down onto the knee. Big clothesline by Tommy Dreamer. Make sure you listen to the House of Hardcore podcast. Whoa, whoa. One, two. Tommy Dreamer going for it. <laughs> oh, is uh, he going to do the 10? I'm sure he will. Ah, he kissed him. He's biting him. Sean Spears has had more random things in his mouth in this matchup than anyone here in Limitless history. What does he got here? Uh, is a that little, a soda pop? It is a little soda. Ow, <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> Oh, not a good night to be Sean Spears. As he catches Dreamer with the elbow, close line cuts. Oh, out of nowhere. Dreamer cutter. A 
Big G fucks up the pin. <laughs> See, I used it properly there. Yes, you sure did. Took me by surprise. I know. Well, you were cursing earlier, Rich. I was. Well, Randy started. I it know. All. It's a very machines. exciting night for Limitless Off the same rope, go for good vibrations! Will it be enough? Legs hooked, two and no, broken oh. up by Sean Spears. Sean Spears driving that forearm into the face of AG. Oh, he caught him on the shoulder, as you can see. AG favoring that shoulder, maybe dislocated. Hopefully he didn't tear something. You know that Sean Spears, with all the years he spent in WWE, whoa, whoa. would love Wait a to minute. ruin AG's shoulder here tonight. What's Anthony Green going for here? Misses, blocked up on the shoulders. Death Valley driver by Spears, Ooh. who gets two and a half. Oh, I was holding my breath there, Rich. I thought that was it, and that running Death Valley driver. Both men down on the canvas. Tommy Dreamer down outside the ring. We have just surpassed 10 minutes from the opening bell. Anthony Green was going for that way more prettier, that unprettier that he likes to do a corkscrew off the corner, but not able to get it. Sean Spears had it scouted. Maybe he's been watching tapes, making sure he could win this matchup and go on to face MJF and bring the limitless title, like MJF says, to AEW. And Spears grabbing the chair. Very reminiscent of what we just saw at AEW's Fighter Fest. This is illegal. What's referee Eric Greenlee? Greenlee just standing there, not attempt. I wouldn't take that away. That is triple threat match. There is no disqualification. Thank you, sir. May I have another? The cane has entered the ring. And Dreamer just told the referee to get out of the way. Oh, jeez. You saw that cane. Wait, did he hit him low? Anthony Green grabs the chair. Dreamer DDT. Wait a minute, AG has wedged the chair into the... Oh, oh wait, no. wait, wait! You gotta believe it, dude, on two, three! Anthony Green pins Tommy Dreamer and he advances to the finals of the Vacation Land Cup!